Okay, so let's say you have a defective fuse. You have checked your voltages and you don't have 240 between these two lugs, but you may have 120 from your ground to one lug and ground to the other lug. You'll have 240 on this side where it comes in then it goes through the fuses, then you won't have 240 here. So to change the fuses, you're gonna take this handle and you're gonna yank it out just like that, okay? And then you're going to see this right there, these fuses just pop right out. Just like that, okay? And then you're going to put it back in. You're going to make sure it seats fully. And then you've got your new fuse in. You got to make sure this on part says on. But if it's flipped over, it says no. That means the fuses are off or it won't give you power basically but so you take this it's got a little rod that lines up with that circle there and once you get that lined up like that give it a good smack just make sure you got it lined up smack it in that's it and then you'll take your your meter and you'll check just like that in between the two lugs you'll see I've got 240 right and then between ground and each one of those lugs I should have 120 so we'll check that real quick so this lug here 120 this lug here 120 this is the line side right here this is before the fuses so if you suspect that you have a problem and you have 240 in between these two and you don't have 240 after it comes out of the fuses then you know you've got a fuse issue so i think that's it